The long-awaited president's speech by Kenyans came to pass. The head of state before outlining the COVID-19 containment measures acknowledged the pressure and anticipation by Kenyans to ease the restrictions. That to open or not to open is not a dilemma between a right and a wrong. It is a dilemma between two rights. The virus is spreading fast and the curve is proving tedious to pattern. It is with this that the president decided to extend the COVID-19 containment measures including the national white dust to dawn curfew and cessation of movement in and out of Nairobi metropolitan and counties of Nairobi, Mombasa, Mandera for 30 more days. That the nationwide dusk to dawn curfew currently in force until today, the 6th of June 2020, is extended for a further 30 days. Cessation of movement that had been imposed in and out of Nairobi's Isli, Old Town in Mombasa and counties of Kilifi and Kwali will however be lifted from Sunday. That in view of the successful containment of the disease in the counties of Kilifi and Kwale, the cessation of movement into and out of the two counties that is currently in force shall also lapse. He, however, changed the commencement time of the nationwide curfew from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. and end time from 5 a.m. to 4 a.m. in the morning. That the cessation of movement into and out of Isli area of Nairobi and the specific limitations in force with respect to the old town area of Mombasa that is currently in force shall lapse at 4 a.m. on the 7th of June 2020. President Kenyatta noted that to reopen the economy, the infections ought to be contained and be headed downwards. He further pointed out that the country's healthcare system is not sufficiently prepared to take on a surge in infections. Therefore, it would not be prudent to ease the restrictions. Within seven days of today, the ministries of interior and health will constitute an interfaith council to work out modalities and protocols of reopening of our places of worship. The head of state said an extraordinary session of the national and county government coordinating summit will convene on Wednesday, June 10th, to review the effectiveness of the containment measures in containing transmission of the coronavirus disease. President Kenyatta made the address amid anxiety from Kenyans who are anticipating that the interim movement between counties would be lifted to enable them to travel to and from the upcountry. Angela Cherur, K24, Weekend Edition.